This is a quick guide video on understanding encoders. Encoders are needed in production line with a variable speed or when the speed of packaging machine is not constant. This diagram shows how an encoder is connected to the HX Nitro via DB9 connector. Note that encoder must be 12 volt DC and both phases of encoder must be connected to the printer. The encoder can be mounted on different areas depending on the type of production line or the product. It can be connected through the shafts, through shaft coupling, conveyor belt, or on the film of the packaging machine. For higher accuracy, the number of pulses per round should be higher than 5000 PPR. Setting the encoder in Vanguard Create. Launch Vanguard Create. Design your message. Proceed to print parameters. Select encoder. Adjust coder parameters. For this type of encoder, set the wheel diameter at 50 millimeters and pulse per round found on the label at 5000. Select second phase. Proceed to home and send the message to the printer. Setting the encoder in HX Manager. Launch HX Manager. Proceed to setting page. Under device configuration, you can adjust the encoder timeout value. Important note, the encoder timeout in HX Manager should be between five to 300 seconds. This means that it will hold the encoder pulse as per the defined timeout value. So when timeout value is zero, the encoder will not work. In case the production line stops in the middle of printing, the printer will wait based on the timeout value. It will resume printing once it receives encoder pulses. Otherwise, printing will be canceled. Click Submit. For more information, please contact technical at maplejet.com.